What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Persistent Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to the channel, Gemini, and you enjoy my content, if you can ring, ring the little bell and find my soul time, I super duper appreciate you saying, saying, saying. This is the oracle reading for the sign of Gemini for the month of March in 2021. This could resonate if you have Gemini in any, any aspects of any of your charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. I did get one message as I was meditating on your energy. And the message uh, is gotcha. So you take it how it resonates in your own life, Gemini. Uh, maybe you caught somebody or maybe it's somebody in your life that got caught. Um, that's all I heard. Gotcha. So you take it how it resonates in your own life. Um, maybe you caught feelings maybe somebody else called feelings i don't know you take it out resonates uh gotcha that's what i heard uh this can resonate like i said if you have gemini in any aspects of any your chart sun moon rising venus or fan behavior or jupiter um it's a free general oracle reading so you only take the messages that resonate with you now we are almost there you guys we're like 30 something peeps away from 2000 subs um, we're almost there. So if you could share, share, share these videos and spread it word of mouth, I'd really appreciate it. Like share them on your social media, because as soon as we get to 2000, I'm going to do deck, deck giveaway number two, but we're not there yet. So energy Oracle deck and a little spirit deck, two separate winners, both new in package. Boom, 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 boom. Just saying. Okay. All right, here we go. Motivation. Someone really has lots of motivation to learn. And motivation to start a side business. Okay. So you take it out resonates in your own life, Gemini. Um, you apparently at least one of you guys have lots of motivation to learn. So it could be learning a new skill, learning a new trade. Um, Feathering your education, your job field, you take it out resonates. Um, and some of you guys um, are motivated to start a side business. So you take it out resonates in your own life, but you have lots of desire, drive, motivation, like fire sign energy to um, either, um, a, or, you're, or you could be in school. So uh, maybe it's a specific, specific, ah, specific subject you're studying that you're really motivated and interested in. You take it out resonates. Volunteer, or it could be motivated to get back into school too. Just saying. Volunteer. Some Gemini's are really going to volunteer in specific areas of their community soon. It's really going to really help their soul. Okay, well you go with your bad self. Heard some Gemini's are very um, motivated to volunteer in specific areas of their community. It's really going to help their soul. So you know, and that's wonderful. Um, it really that does help mental health absolutely. When you know you can contribute to um, your community in a positive way, and it sounds like at least one of you guys are going to start doing that. That's great. And in particular, Gemini is going to volunteer very important information in a questioning soon it's really going to help the wheel move fast to help the family in a positive way oh okay well, you go with your bad self jim um i heard at least one of you guys is going to um um give information important information on a questioning soon um that's really going to help the wheel move fast so one it's a questioning it sounds like you're going to be questioned um about a specific situation regarding a family. And the information you're gonna provide is gonna be very helpful and useful and it's gonna help the wheel move fast positively for the family. So that's great. So you're gonna volunteer information is what it looks like. Heavenly signs. A particular Gemini has been getting very strong intuitive signs from the universe soon. I mean, I'm sorry, not recently, soon. Um, to really help the family they're about to okay 
I heard a particular Gemini has been getting very strong signs from the universe recently to help the family, and they're about to. We've got a family and a Gemini helping a, helping a family coming in very, very, very strong. So you got heavenly signs. So I heard you've been getting very strong intuitive signs from the universe. Now, the universe is the collective. It's the 3D. It's the world we live in, the everyday 3D world. So you've been getting very strong signs in your own world to um, get you, um, to lead you to help to um, motivate you to help this family in some type of way. Intuition. A particular Gemini's third eye has really been open recently. They are seeing much, much, much more clearly now. Okay. Heard a particular Gemini's third eye has really been open recently. Um, it's causing you to see much more clear, clearly now. So it sounds like your third eye was not opened in the past, but it's opening now. Now you see in the picture, her third eye, it's right here. That's the sixth chakra, it's right here. Um, it's basically intuition, cognition. Intuition is basically your gut feeling, whether you should or shouldn't do something. Um, cognition is mental, but it's um, when it's open, I heard it's open recently, You, it opens you up to possibly receive gifts from the universe. Um, gifts from spirit. So like clear audience, clairvoyance, clear sentience, like I hear clear audience from spirit, spirit, those kind of gifts from, um, from spirit. If spirit chooses to give them to you, you know, they could choose to give them, them to you or not, but if it's open, you have that possibility. But I heard somebody's um, third eye has been open recently. So your third eye has been open recently and you've been getting signs from the universe for some of you guys to help a family. So that's probably why your third eye has been opening. You've been really, really putting yourself out there in a positive way in the spirit world. Um, and they're blessing you with, um, that you might be get, possibly get blessed with gifts, possibly for some of you guys. I'm not saying you have, but possibly you take it how it resonates. Clean your space. Some Gemini's really need to clear their energy field from negative energies that were once there. Sage would be good. Okay. For some of you guys really need to clear your energy field from negative people that were once there. Sage would be good. Um, so sage sticks, um, they honestly look like giant blunts to be honest with you, but it's not. Um, but they kind of do. Um, but you can Google them. You can order them off walmart.com. Um, many places or, um, have them. You can either even get them in Walmart, like physical stores, but they're just so freaking expensive if you do it that way. But um, they're sage bundles and you light them, you smudge, meaning you go around your house and you just, it's like an incense, giant incense. And it clears out the negative energy and leaves in the positive. Apparently some people have some very negative people in their life recently or in the past, um, physically in your space and you need to clear your actual space you live in. I'm assuming your home. Um, you take out resonates walking in beauty. A particular Gemini has really had a glow up recently, really been taking care of their skin and their external physical self. It's really showing. Okay, you go with your bad self, Gemini. I heard a particular Gemini has really had a huge glow up recently. Uh, you've been taking care of your skin and your uh, physical. So maybe you got your hair done, a new hairstyle, or your, your skin's looking all nice and glowy, um, or all maybe all those things. Um, but you've got the walking and beauty card. So you, uh, you're taking care of your physical, your external self. And it's really showing in the 3D. So the everyday world we live in. That's beautimous, Gemini. Spirit of fire. A fire sign is very significant in a lot of Gemini's lives. Okay. I heard a fire sign is very significant in a lot of Gemini's lives. So you take it out resonates. We have the spirit of fire card. Now I heard a fire sign. So 
uh, fire signs are Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They could have Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Node, Behavior, Jupiter. I heard a particular fire sign is very significant in a lot of you guys' life. So it could be the person, the maybe the head of the per, uh, family you're about to help out. That could be a fire sign or some other kind of fire sign that's significant in your life. It's an Aries Leo Sag. They could have Aries Leo Sag in the Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter. You take it out, resonates. It could be a spouse. It could be a manager, boss, CEO. It could be a supervisor. It could be a friend, a neighbor, a coworker. You take it out, resonates. Uh, a spouse, a partner, a former partner. You take it out, take it out resonates. Breaking trail. A breakthrough is at hand. A particular Gemini is about to have a huge mental breakthrough soon. It's going to be very, very, very positive for this Gemini. It's going to get, cause many positive series of chain of events for them and a family. Family energy coming in very, very strong in here. Gemini, holy crap. I heard um, a particular Gemini is about to have a huge positive breakthrough, huge positive mental breakthrough in your life soon. So if this resonates with you, you're going to have a huge positive mental breakthrough soon in your life. So not a mental breakdown. I mean, that's not funny, but seriously, it's opposite. It's like a mental glow up. It's like a, like a huge realization and epiphany in a positive way, but it's about you and a family. I heard many series positive, many series of positive chain of events is going to occur. Um, it could be you helping this family is what I'm thinking. Um, and causing you to, um, divulge the information that's what I'm thinking reaching your destination your light is shining brightly a particular Gemini feminine <clears throat> is about to get lots of praise in her workplace soon because of events that are about to unfold where they're going to really positively shine. Okay, well you go to your bad self, Jim. Her Gemini feminine is about to very positive, about to really shine brightly in their workplace situation soon because of many uh, many events that are about to unfold in their workplace. But this Gemini fem is about to really shine bright, so they're about to be positively recognized in their workplace because of some kind of events that are about to happen. Great adventure, take a risk, venture forward. Some Geminis are planning vacations soon to very adventurous, adventurous places. It's going to be very positive for your mental health. Okay, you go through bad self. I heard some of you guys are really planning very adventurous vacations soon um, to very I mean, whatever you're going to be doing, it's going to be really fun and adventurous. It could be scuba diving, uh, zip lining, um, bungee jumping, something very adventurous, hiking, skiing, snowboarding, um, probably not snowboarding in March, but we're skiing, but um, you take it out resonates, something very adventurous, but I heard it's going to be very good for your mental health. So you take it out resonates. That's great. All right, let's see if I hear anything else. Cheese is what I heard. Oh, cheese, like cheese, like taking a photo cheese is what I, because I heard like, it'd be like capital C-H-E-E-S-E -E -E exclamation point, like cheese, like smile, cheese. That's how I heard it. So you take it how it resonates in your own life. You could be posing for pictures. You could be telling somebody to pose for pictures. Um, you take it how it resonates. All right, you guys, I love you guys so freaking much. Everybody make good choices and namaste. Share, share, share the videos, please, please, please. And word of mouth. Love you. Namaste.